Hey guys, welcome back to About Technology. In this video, I am going to show you how you can reduce size of the file that you are rendering using DaVinci Resolve. So without further ado, let's get started. First, suppose I have a clip on my timeline whose original size is 84.9 MB, which is 84,900 KB. Now, I want to render it again with the reduced size. So let's click on Deliver. And the first thing that you might think of is reduce the resolution of your video. But in my opinion, it is not a good idea as it is going to degrade the quality of your video. Instead, we can play around the quality of the video. If you can notice, we have two modes, automatic mode and restricted mode. I have set restricted mode to 10,000 kilobytes per second. But if you go to automatic mode, we have few options. We can go from best to least. So let us first render the video with the best quality. So I'll select best over here and in the file name, I'll name it as best. Let me browse the location. Here, I have created a folder best to least in which I am going to render all the videos from best quality to least quality. So let's open it. Now, I have named my video as best. Click on save and now I would click on add to render queue. Here, I would simply click on render. Now, after rendering the video with the best quality, let us now render it with high quality. Here, in quality, in automatic mode, I have selected high, so I would name the file as high. Location of the file will be same and I'll click on add to render queue. Now let's render the video with high quality. Go on and click on render. To show you the difference in the size of the file from best quality to least quality, I have rendered the same video from best to least one. So now let us get into the folder where I have rendered all these videos and look into their sizes. The original video was of 87,000 kilobytes and the best one is of 75,000 kilobytes. Next the high one is of 52,000 kilobytes. Medium one is of 37 kilobytes. Low one is of 29 kilobytes and the least one is of 21 kilobytes. Now let me play the original one for you. And now let us play the best one. I don't feel much difference between the original and the best clip, though there is a noticeable change in their sizes. Now let's go ahead and play the high one. Even this seems fine to me, but when we pause, we miss some of the details of the video. Let's go ahead and now play the low one. Alright, as we have moved from best to least, the size of the file has reduced which was our main intention behind the video. But we have also seen moving from best to least also degrades the quality of video at each level. If required, you can even set this restricted value from 10,000 to 5,000 kilobits. So just go on and play around the quality settings and decide what you want. So that's it guys. If you want to know how you can blur anything in your video in DaVinci Resolve, please click on the video at the top right corner of your screen. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more DaVinci Resolve videos, please subscribe this channel. It will notify you when any new video comes out. Feel free to comment below and let us know what other new videos would you like to see in future. Hope you enjoyed this video. See you next. Bye bye.